Visit ZombieGoBoom.com for K-Bar, Cold Steel, Ivan Targets, and more. Help support the show and keep it free. ZGB Top 10. Whoa. Holy crap. Number 9. Ugh. Oh, oh my god. Oh, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> Number eight. Shockwave action. Mike actually got hit with a piece of the crystal skull from about 50 yards away. How'd that feel, Mike? Uh, it was surprising to say the least. <laughs> uh, we were back there for safety reasons. Uh -huh. We never expected the shrapnel to sure. travel that yeah. far. Number seven. We saw what this thing can do with four inches. Let's see if it can whack off eight. Oh my god! <laughs> well, we broke the hammer. Uh, <laughs> uh, that was uh, that was totally unexpected. Number six. Number five. Go. You're dripping. Go. It's still on fire. Still on fire. Now, I'm not certain, but that might have been the coolest thing we've ever done! God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! Whoa. You okay, Nate? Yeah, I'm fine. Holy crap, that could have been terrible. Did I tell you? What did I tell you? <laughs> Didn't I tell you? I told you it's did gonna you get be glass broken. on you. What? Are you okay? Did you get caught? I no. mean, as far as I know, I'm okay. Did you feel glass? There's glass all over you. So is zombie dead? That. I mean, that could have pierced you, my friend. Hot. You got coke all over the lens, too. It. Number three. So, as it turns out, we need to be a little bit safer because when Charles shot the Kevlar helmet, the entire jacket with lead still inside of it bounced back. And uh, according to Alec, uh, it actually hit Charles, but, you know, he's the executioner, so he didn't feel anything. I didn't feel shite. But, look at that. Isn't that amazing? I want to keep that. Don't try this at home. We're professional idiots, so... They are, not yeah. me. <laughs> he usually person. exercises more safety than we do. Um, Alright, let's do this thing again and see if we don't die. Number two. I'm Charles Fultz, and this is the SOG Tactical Tomahawk. Whoa. Whoa. Holy crap. I did not expect that to happen. No, that's amazing. We could have been severely injured. This is not funny. It's kind of scary, actually. <laughs> I thought we were at the first thing that happened when it broke, we were just like checking ourselves to make sure we didn't have like a piece of metal sticking out. I thought for sure that it went into one of our camera guys. Oh my god. 
This is crazy. This is really crazy. See, we test things to the limit here at Zombie Go Boom. You can't, can't blame us for that. Number one. why we do these kind of tests because if this is where if this were the actual apocalypse uh, this would probably mean I would be dead with you know by infection within like a few days maybe even sooner this is a pretty bad cut but I'm going to forego going to the hospital and just wrap it up and see what happens here it comes please squeeze this oh. that's one Good God! Yeah, it's, mm, it's mostly cold. <laughs> there. Uh, like eh, 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 scissors. Eh. I think I'll live. I think I will live. Hey, what's up, survivors? Chuck Murray here. I just want to let you guys know real quick that the new and improved Zombie Go Boom store is finally open, and there are some products that you may be familiar with, like the Ivan Heads and the Executioner Swords. But there are definitely some products that you guys are not familiar with, like these dog tags with a certificate of ZGB membership. Plus, the bracelets are back, the nunchucks are back, and the Kali sticks are back for some epic zombie murdering. So please make sure you get your products today only at zombiegoboom.com.